On behalf of Tyler and Lauren, I want to say welcome and thank you for being a part of this special day. After four years of everyone else knowing that this day was coming, you finally made it. We're excited, all of us are excited and honored to be a part of this special day in your life. Now, Tyler, you and Jake, you told me the story about you and Jake calling her in your, I think it was Old Testament class, the late girl, right? <laughs> but today she's right on time. This is your special someone, the one that you've been waiting for. We're here to celebrate your coming together today in the covenant of marriage. Lauren and Tyler, today is a very exciting day. Lauren, as everyone knew and expected, you're a beautiful, radiant bride. After four years of everyone else knowing that this day was coming, you finally made it. We're excited, all of us are excited and honored to be a part of this special day in your lives. Covenant marriage also displays a commitment of love. Not just love, but committed love. A lot of people fall in love, but they don't have committed love. We celebrate that today. Covenant marriage reflects that commitment of love, that you're committed to her, and that she's committed to you for the rest of your lives. You have to have the attitude that nothing will come between you. No matter what, nothing will come between you. You're committed to stay together. You're committed to love each other. You're committed to grow in your love and you're committed to have a great marriage. This is your special someone, the one that you've been waiting for and God provided what you were waiting for. We're here to celebrate your coming together today in the covenant of marriage. And Tyler, to you, Lauren, to be my wife, my constant friend, my love from this day forward. In the presence of God, our family, and our friends, I offer you my solemn vow to be your faithful partner in sickness and in health, in good times and in bad. I promise to love you un unconditionally, to support you in your goals, to honor and respect you, to laugh with you and cry with you, and to cherish you for as long as we both shall live. I want to take you, Tyler, to be my husband, my constant friend, and my love from this day forward. In the presence of God, our family, and friends, I offer you my solemn vow to be your faithful partner in sickness and in health, in good times and in bad. I promise to love you unconditionally, to support you in your goals, to honor you and respect you, to laugh with you and cry with you, and to cherish you for as long as we both shall live. Tyler and Lauren, having made a lifelong covenant to each other in love, with Jesus Christ at the center as a minister of the gospel of our living Lord Jesus Christ in the presence of these witnesses and in his presence, I pronounce you husband and wife. Tyler, <laughs> you can kiss your bride. And uh, Lauren, <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> She's beautiful. Tyler's a good, a, a great guy, and uh, we've gotten to know him so well. So, on top of, um, with that being said, we love y'all. Y'all are great. She's just a solid friend. She loves Tyler. I mean, loves him. Love, love, loves him. Um, Tyler, uh, I just thank you for loving her well. Tate really, he really couldn't have found a better girl to marry, honestly. I mean, you guys are the perfect match. And I tell him every day, every time that we talk, how lucky you really just are. You know what I mean? You really are. <laughs>